what is up guys it is nick we are back on rise or yeah, rise on shadow of the tomb raider we're continuing today my week has been crazy i apologize for the limited uploads it's been crazy with work and homework um but i think we're finally in a good place and i can make sure and get videos up have both tomb raider and we'll start assassin's creed tomorrow I'll get to recording that as soon as I get the game disc. I ordered, I don't know. I'll talk about that in that video. I'm still a little tilted about the whole thing. Unarachi must be worried about Etsley. I have to tell her he's been captured. You know that's not going to be it. Unaratu. Hetzley's been captured. I know. They're holding him at the barracks. We're working on a plan to release him. I tried to get to him. I'm sorry. He's a warrior. What's that? This is a key. It looks like... It looks like it belonged to the mountain temple. It is adjacent to where they're holding him. Is the box of each shell connected to the barracks? Is that why the cult occupied the temple? It's heavily guarded. When we go in, it has to be subtle, silent. Is there a back way? Th there was one by the salt mine, but it has deteriorated. It's treacherous. I might be able to manage it. Perhaps. You did survive the sacrificial pit. I haven't been back inside since I was a child. But from what I can remember, the barracks are within an inner stronghold. If I can get in through the back way, I can clear a path and let you in. We will free Etsley, then go find the box. I'll take care of myself. You go after the box. Oh, are we supposed to go this way? I guess we're supposed to go this way. Maybe not. Hey, Laura. Do you have a minute? Uchu and I were talking, and, well... Uchu, what's on your mind? The day of Edsley's coronation is approaching. Soon he will be a man and take the first steps towards becoming Paititi's future king. Oh, that sounds like a day to look forward to. It's the hope for that day that keeps a lot of us fighting Amaru and his cult. Sometimes we all need to remember what we're fighting for. Is there something I can help you with? When Esli's father, Sairi, died, Unaratu bestowed the honor of surrogate father onto me. One of my duties is to gather three sacred items for the ceremony, but... But with all that's happening right now, you aren't able to. What are these items? They are the Savior's amulet, the champion's bow, and the king's horn. Each a blessing from the ancestors of the future king. Tell me what you need, and I'll see what I can do. I already have men retrieving the amulet and bow, but if you could find Kabil, the instrument maker, and get the king's horn from him, he would be doing us a great favor. He's been difficult. I sent two men and both have failed. Perhaps you could talk to his wife. I think I can manage that. Be mindful. Kabil can be prickly sometimes, but Abra, his wife, has a way of dulling his edges. All right, so we got to speak to Kabil. All right, so that pseudo objective is down here, and then okay, so we'll do this objective first. I guess it's not a, it's not an objective. It's a side quest. I will for sure get Assassin's Creed out every day, or I will do my best. If it's if I'm gonna skip an episode at this point, it's gonna be of this series. But 
we will finish this series. Father, father, come quick. It's the Ishiki. What do you want? We don't have time for Unuratu's rebellion right now. Are you Kabil? Uchu sent me for the king's... The king's horn? The call to the future? <laughs> Look at the good that future's done for my present. Just go. The cult found out my dad was making the horn. They poisoned our crops as punishment. Mom got sick. My brother Kuali went to the market to get herbs, but he hasn't returned. That's terrible. Let me see if I can find your brother and get the herbs you need. Thank you. All right, where is the subjective point in us now? Did you hear about Kuali? No. <laughs> Oh, hold on. Kuali took it upon himself to steal the herbs she needs to get well. Excuse me. Ah, Ishiki. How can I help you? I'm looking for Kuali, the son of Kabil. That poor boy. Chimali, one of Kukulkan's thugs, is holding him in a cell up at the market, waiting for the Ahau to come to punish him. Thank you. Be well, Ishiki. Alright, so up to the market. Thieving bastard. I told you to shut Here we go. The herb thief. He must be very dangerous. Today it's theft, and tomorrow it's murder. That's quite a leap, don't you think? You really want to know what I think? I think we should round up all these little rats and drown them. Every one of them, especially you mill. His father may be a serpent guard, but he is not. Talk to Yamil. Alright, back down the mountain we go. Wait, where the heck is this? No way, up the mountain we go. This is all my. Come on, get it! Are you me? Hello there. Hey, you're Ishiki, from the outside, right? Yes, it's nice to meet you. Well, me, I'm Yamil. <laughs> what sort of game are you boys playing? It's not a game. My father is a serpent guard, a priest. I took his ceremonial knife to show my friends, and Shimali the guard saw. Shimali knows what father would do if he found out I took the knife, so he threw it up there. Now it's stuck. Oh, let me see what I can do. Wow, really? Thank you. It's up where? Oh, just up here? Drop down. Thank you, Ishiki. You're welcome. Hey, wait a minute. The grown-ups around here always chase us away. But you helped. What do you want? Shh. I'll do the talking. So what do you want, Ishiki? I mean, is there something we can do to pay you back? I'm trying to help Kuali. You're too late. He's been sentenced to death. We can't do anything. And Chimali the guard hates you. Would Chimali chase you if you provoked him? Why? Because if he's not at his post, I can get to Kuali. Yeah, I like it. Oh, you can tell Kuali to meet us at the cave. He'll know where it is. It'll be safe for him there. I will. Let's go. Asto, Remy, with me. Samin, watch our backs. Then run to the cave. Stand back, Ishiki. We'll give you an opening. Chimali, you coward! You'll end your life as a slave! Come taste my blade! <laughs> yeah, and these llama patties, too! Run, run! Really? <laughs> This is all my fault. Please, they were just herbs. I beg. Your brother told me of your troubles. Wait, who are you? Someone who wants to help. I never wanted any of these to happen. I was only trying to help my mother get well. Where are the herbs? Give them to me. I will heal your mother. Go. Your friends are waiting for you at the cave. Thank you. Here are the herbs. I'll run as fast as I can.
All right, back to Kabil we go. What were you doing with your friends near the buildings? I thought I told you to go. Kuali is safe, and I have the herbs your wife needs. Really? Then did you come to cure her, or to barter for the king's horn? Here. This will help you. Bless you, Ishiki. Kabil, quit being an ass. Give her the horn. <sighs> Here. With respect to the future king. Thank you for all you've done. Thank you. All right. Gotta take the horn back now, which is good. We gotta go back this way anyway. Ah, Matukulti. After we get up here and we talk to this guy and give him the horn, talk a little life, a little personal. Let's see. Look for that. Last to leave and first to return. Jonah's stories of you are true. The king's horn, as requested. Did Kabil give you any trouble? You were right about his wife. She definitely had a way with his heart. Thank you for this, Lara. Of course. Uchu, what did you mean, last to leave and first to return? The men I have retrieving the other two items, they both left three days ago. Neither has returned. Do you think something's happened to them? It's Quincy that concerns me the most. He's young, likes to take risks. Jumps into the water before checking to see how deep it is. I know the type. Jonah. Jonah's right. That describes Quenty perfectly. I never should have sent Quenty to that damn place. Mm, what place is that? The old cistern. It's where the remains of Manko are kept hidden from the cult. Who is Manko? He was a farmer who led Sairi and Amaru's ancestors out of Cusco to safety centuries ago. He is known as the peasant savior. It's his amulet we need for the coronation. Why was Manko hidden away? Manko's followers were known as the Order of the Peasant Savior. This rebellion was born from it. When the cult of Kukulkan first took power, they tried to wipe out the Order. Manko was hidden away in a secret place and kept safe. But over time, as the Order dwindled, the memory of that place has faded. If you like, I could go look for Quenti. You've done a lot already. Bringing back the King's Horn was a big gesture of friendship. I don't mind, really. Maybe Quenti can show me the best cliffs to jump off. Please don't encourage him. The entrance to the cistern is a cave above the white tree. Follow the trail. It'll lead you to it. Alright, I guess our quest isn't over. We got some money out of that. Got a skill point as well. I believe that brings us up to two. We need three to get done what I want to get done. Uh, but what I was going to say is that I apologize for not getting everything up. I have... I, I don't want to call it a hard schedule, but I have some classes that I just can't quite make the dialect out. I'm just not as confident in as I usually am with my college classes, so struggling a bit and having to spend. Entrance to the cistern was a cave above the white tree. So I'm having to spend a little bit of extra time on some of these things. I don't know how. Oh, there we go. Okay. So I'm having to spend extra time on those classes, and they're getting harder, obviously, as I go. Okay, really? And so that's why when there's delays on episodes, that's... 99.9% .9 of the reason why there's a delay. There's the entrance. And on top of that, I'm taking six classes. Hold on. Oh, she didn't say anything. 
usually I would drop one and uh, just just live and take it another time. But they're all they're both of them are prerequisites for things I need, and it really would set me back to drop one of them. So I have to have to power through the six classes I have. Suck it up. And then I have a couple other classes that are easy. They're just super time-consuming, like hours and hours and hours of homework every week. And there's no fast way to take care of them. No one's been through here in centuries. This has to be the right place. Hello, game? Almost got this to 100%. And there it is, 100%. Quachua language. Can't fit under that. Manco's resting place. This looks suspicious. What if I try and... Hold on, let me do it this way. Oh, the, the game was smarter than me. Hold on, let me get some air. The game outsmarted me. I, th I thought I could... You could almost jump that. They almost made that too short that you can jump it. Which would have been hilarious, in my opinion. Alright, let's come up for air. And go. Up. This looks like a procession of the dead. It's the order hiding Manco from the cult of Kukul Khan. The Cult of Kukulkan. Okay, before I do that, anything else in this room? Nope. Alright, what does this do? Shit, no. Oh hell. Go down. Hurry up. Where do I need to get to? Way up there. How does this... I guess let's go in here. This is the only option. Okay. Here we go. Oh, uh, hold on. This shows Look at this. burial dolls, pottery, and textiles being placed in here with the dead. This wasn't just a hiding place. The order turned it into a crypt. Push this bad boy in. Go, baby! There we go. Where to now? Okay, in here. The Order left members behind as sentinels when they sealed the system. All these bones, they sacrificed themselves to protect this place. I always, I always tilt, so I sent an email to one of my teachers that I kind of needed a response to, just simply, oh crap, oh hurry up. Come on, 
Squeeze through. Squeeze. Up, up, up. Hurry up. Oh, God, I'm caught on something. There we go. But he hasn't responded. It's been like... Now. It's been... Where's the amulet? It's been like four hours, and I'm like still waiting for the email response, and I'm like, come on, dude. Now, to get this back to Uchu. There's light coming through this wall. Another sealed off passageway, I bet. Where's the kid that he sent to do this? But yeah, so I've been waiting all day for an email back from my professor, and he's like, yeah, Mondays, great office hours. And I'm like, whatever, my dude, clearly not. That was the way we came in. Okay, so now we just go out. Okay. And I really have no problem with him taking four hours to respond. I just, it annoys me because he's like, oh yeah, Monday is a great time to email me. I usually get back to you really quickly. And like, clearly that is not the case, homie. He's like, yeah, I only have one class. It's early in the morning. Ooh, got a little spicy there. Got a little spicy and didn't make the jump there. I did find a new, I found a new camp site. Oh gosh, oh gosh. How do you get down off of this? How the heck do you get down off of this? Or am I just going the wrong way? Is this the way you're supposed to go? I don't see a thing to attach. Hum, 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 hum. Oh, you can just... I'm stupid. You can just jump off into the water. I have some dumb moments when I play this. I really do. Like some extra, extra stupid moments. Uh, let's go around this way. Make sure I know. Make sure I get to the place I need to get to. Alright, up the ladder. All right. Let's see if he's gonna make me go get the other item. Ah, Lara. Quinty returned a short while ago. A little worse for wear, but alive. I'm glad to see you're okay as well. That system is quite a challenge. I'm happy Quinty made it back. Uh, but without the savior's amulet, I'm afraid. You mean this savior's amulet? What? Lara, you found it. That's incredible. Here. I can't thank you enough. When Zan returns with the champion's bow, we will honor all of the gatherers. Including you, if you join us. I'll be there. Ah, achievement unlocked. Hearts and minds. Retrieve Minko's necklace. So that should give what us... What are doing here? Gives us five skill points. Nice. And so now I can do this so I can lock onto three targets at once. Beautiful. We haven't been in combat for a while, but we will get back there. What is this over here? No. Poe is below. I'm going to go with this just because I want to be... Uh, what is this? Hold on. 
I'm going to grab this. I think this is more important. I'm going to do this as well, just in case for future. For future reference, we'll unlock this later. Um, let me see about... Let me see about upgrade. So, you really got to be able to upgrade the recurve bow or the exiled fox's bow to make them better. Um... Just a weird outfit. We could go back to this outfit. Yeah, you know what? We're going out on the hunt. Actually, no, we're still doing. Let, let's put let's put back the the traditional uniform. The traditional uniform for these people so uh i think that's gonna do it for this episode i don't really think we have time to hop into like the main story at this point so i think we'll call it an episode here and in the next one we will take on the main story plot once again so i hope you all enjoyed and i'll catch you guys then peace out